You're watching TDC News. The Nigeria Postal Service, NIPOST, is to carry out an upgrade of its facilities across the country to improve service delivery. Postmaster General of the Federation, Dr. Ismail Adewusi, stated this while inspecting postal offices in Oshun State. Rafiu Hamid completes this report. The Nigeria Postal Service, NIPOST, is a government owned and operated corporation established in 1987. It has more than 12,000 employees and over 3,000 post offices across the country. Despite its presence in almost all the local governments in Nigeria, its services are still not satisfactory. Postmaster General of the Federation is on tour of facilities of NIPOST in Ocean State. The essence is to see how postal formations managed to survive during lockdown and to also have for stand information about the challenges facing the staff. We still have a lot of work to do in terms of um, enhancing our physical infrastructure. In many of the post offices that I've been to have seen the need to upgrade our facilities in IT, in uh, physical building infrastructure, in uh, transportation infrastructure, and all of that. And I think that we have taken note of some of these areas and we will continue to address them. He speaks on plans to enhance operations of NIPOST. Do. In China, for example, the biggest and the largest bank in China is the Post Bank of China with about 800 million customers. And the kind of deposit they gather is in trillions. And so we want to replicate this uh, in Nigeria. You recall that when we were getting when we were younger, we had the Post Office Savings Bank, first Federal Savings Bank at some point. He also led members of his delegation on a courtesy call to the state governor, Boye Gawitola, in his office. Night Post United seem to have the, the highest number of properties in Nigeria. There's no town, no city that you don't have a Night Post. So you have a lot of properties. So these properties have been abandoned for years. So setting up a company to, to now look at the opportunities of either participating in the PPP with some private sector developers to turn around the future and make revenue for the United Post. Bui Gawitola promised to support the operations of Night Post in the state. Rafiu Hamid, TVC News, Ushubu.